Alright, y'all. So we're in jail. There have been many Dragon Quests where you've been thrown in jail before. I love being in jail. I love role-playing. The helpless guy who's, uh, imprisoned. Can I think of anything? Got it. Stand back. Uh, I like My favorite time being in jail is in Super Paper Mario for the Nintendo Wii. That was pretty cool. You, you know, you know, you got you were in jail and you had to like jump for a living like a slave. I loved it. I liked having a job and stuff. And then you got he had upgraded to gerbil and he had to run in a hamster wheel. Someone's coming. That was great. That was a great instance of actually being forced to work for your sins or even if you're set up and etc. That was great. I loved it. Good evening, everyone. Glad to see you're all looking so well. Uh, come here, you! Now, now, control your temper. I must apologize for before. Perhaps you will accept this as conciliation. What are you up to? The guard upstairs might hear if we talk now. I'll explain later. Come on. Follow me. The guard's up ahead. Right, no one make a sound. I seasoned his supper with a generous pinch of sleeping powder. I haven't done not make any sound. Perfect. It worked. Sleeping like a baby. Okay, through here. Great, we're safe in here. You can talk again now. Good! Tell us what's going on. What ordeal do you intend to put us through next, hmm? Like I said, I'm sorry about before. If I hadn't lied about the ring, Marcello would have been onto me like a shot. Like a shot? And I haven't got anywhere else to go if I'm chucked out of here. But I came to get you out, didn't I? <sighs> Come on, don't be angry. Anyway, let me show you something you won't have seen before. Well, what is it? There. And that's real blood on those spikes, you know. If I were to throw you in there and shut the door, your whole body would be skewered. I could make you holier than thou without so much as getting my hands dirty. Puns. <laughs> Can you hear me out there? There's a secret passage in here! Like I said, not bad, eh? Your game, eh? First you grass on us for something we ain't done, and then you come and help us. Sorry if I've confused you. The people here have a bit of a trust issue with me. I couldn't stick up for you before. It would have backfired. The man who interrogated you, Marcello, he hates me. That's why I had to let him put you in the cells before I could help you. That's all well and good. But you still don't know us from Adam. Ain't you worried about us being friends with this old monster, eh? You're just happy to let us go, are ya? True, I don't know anything about you. And I wasn't there when you were caught. But I do know you saved the abbot's life. Because just before you were brought to the interrogation room, the sinister feeling that's been lingering in the air went away. I must thank you for that. 
I'm not so ruthless that I'd hang you out to dry. And besides, I couldn't stand by while there was a lady in trouble. Marcello's a rather talented inquisitor, you know. What does that mean? This leads outside. Medea. Hey, hey. Do you know who we are? Medea. My Medea. This is the hay storage. Safe. That's where all the sheep are. Were you lonely without me? There, there. It's all right. We'll leave this horrible place at once. The princess and I will go on ahead. Make sure you're not too far behind. It's really nice how they uh, reuse, or I mean, they didn't use this in the first princess. place. Whatever. Come on, let's go. It's nice that I can recognize where I am. Mess up your escape from here. Anyway, I'm sorry for all the trouble. So this is farewell. May the goddess watch over you on your journey. Thank okay, you. Yeah, remember? Storage. This is the door that looks weird. I guess we gotta go get a tool magus. Whoever he... Is. The bridge. Is the whole abbey on fire? Surely that jester didn't come back again. Munchie, he's so cute. Oh no. I've got to save the abbot. I'll help you out, you nerd. Ah, here we go. See? Sugiyama only has like four songs. And then you're just like... I use them and stuff. They don't seem to fit very well. If you want to play the Dragon Quest with the greatest soundtrack, Definitely, I recommend giving four and six a listen. I think they have the most songs, because four is divided in chapters, and every chapter, every chapter you play is different party members, and every group of members has their own theme song, and it's pretty great. Uh, if you know who Piadane is, he sings a bunch of junk and whatever. His Dragon Quest ones are so fun to listen to. And they're all like, whatever. They're barely spoiler free. I mean, they're spoiler free. They don't really like... Oh, I don't know. Maybe they're not spoiler free. But his Dragon Quest 4 songs are so fun. I love listening to it. But maybe it's just because I like Dragon Quest already, who knows. Here's the song. Oh, I know that guy. Yeah? Everyone cares about Angela over there. Oh, you know. We're just like, save the abbot. Isn't this is like fight music or whatever. I'm... <sighs> it's okay, Sugiyama. You're still cool. You made that really. You made that rock and uh, opening theme. Keep on rocking, rocking all yeah. Fire! Aren't you guys going? Oh, he's the coward. He's just standing there. He's not even going. He's just walking in a circle. Yeah. 
You know, in other games, it's like take 10 damage per step. But it looks like it's a story event and it doesn't matter. <laughs> I can't just so nonchalant. Sinister presence again. No, not sinister. It's worse than that. It's pure evil. As if all the demons of hell had gathered to feast upon Abbot Francisco. It's locked from the inside. Marcello? Are you in there? Damn! What's going on? Time to collect three items, gather them all together in this no spot, good. chant for five minutes, and then the door you will open. Did you follow me here? Doesn't matter. You fall. I need your help. Us here. Just one last time, alright? We're going to have to do this by brute force. There might just be enough of us. What about the item collection? The door's locked from the inside. We've got to break it down. Come on, everyone together. If this works, I'll eat my shorts. Nom, 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 nom. Yes. Honestly, why aren't more solutions that uh, intuitive? Like that was. Amp the elbow. Elbow. You know, I really like this elbow. Have it. He makes good fish puns. Yeah. I gotta fight to Omegas. Marcello. It was all that jester. I couldn't stop him. You got a little like black. He's strong. Ominous aura on your uh, <gasps> shoulder there. But you can't let him. This is an order, Templar Angelo. Get the abbot to safety. <laughs> now, nothing stands in my way. Ugh. You dare lay a finger on Abbot Francisco. Don't worry, Marcello. I will be fine. I have given myself to the goddess. If it is her wish, I am prepared to die. But, wretched sinner, if that is not her wish, nothing you can do will ever harm me. The goddess will protect us all from whatever evil you can muster. Well, well, what faith you have. Let's put it to the test, shall we? Wait, 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 wait! <laughs> Go, blimey! It's been a while, Dual Magus. Ah, if it isn't King Toad, looking as small and ugly as ever. Ah, Toad, Toad. Let's get the jerk. Shut up! Return my daughter and I to normal at once! Do you realize what you've done to my castle? I think you might realize. Oh, 
No. Did I make it? Did he die? No. Uh, what? I liked him. He made such a pity. He made fish pots. It seems fate and your benevolent goddess are both on my side. <laughs> yes, such a pity. Poor Francisco. <laughs> my work here is done. Parting is such sweet sorrow. Do I have this button? I pressed the button. Ah, you're awake. I realize I said it before the funeral, but I just wanted to assure you that everyone knows you're innocent. If it weren't for you, Captain Marcello could well have been killed too. We're all in your debt. Anyway, the Templar captain has summoned you to his office. See you later, then. Don't forget. Ah, oh, you're awake. You awake, too? Yeah, you are. Four. Ah, there you are. I trust you slept well. King Trode has explained everything. I apologize for having doubted you. 
Abdul Magus is the true culprit. In the name of the goddess, we must strike down that diabolical jester. I'm on trying. But I cannot leave here now. As the new abbot, I have much mm. to do. I must be here to guide my people. So, I was wondering, according to what King Trode tells me, you are all pursuing Dulmagus. So I have a proposal. I would like my brother Angelo to accompany you on your quest. Brother? I thought you said you wouldn't have a rule breaker as a brother. Quiet! I wasn't talking to you. Angela, you are the only one we can spare at the moment. <laughs> oh, really? Everyone, Everyone else. else here has duties to fulfill. Only you are without such responsibilities. I'm useless, you mean. No need to beat about the bush. Fine, I understand. You've made yourself perfectly clear. I will leave the Abbey. I will travel with these people. And I will avenge the Abbot's murder. Well... Whatever. I'll be waiting by the carriage with Medea then. This is a map of the world. If you're going to catch Dulmagus, this is a reward. I'm sure you'll find it indispensable. Consider it a peace offering for having doubted you and your friends. Please. I don't want it. Very well then. I entrust Angelo to your care and wish you well on your journey. <laughs> 